It's not a walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly so you can see what it looks like. So this is um, the Palm Springs Open by ABC Sports. I've never heard of them. On the Philips CDI. I will be completely rubbish having never played this before. I've had a very, very brief look at the instructions. But you know me, I don't really do instructions. This holds 350 yards, par 4, with a blind green. Okay. Let's pick a club. I don't really know. Oh, okay. Hopefully, it picks a good default club. No, we'll, we'll go. Oh, get off. I'm going to go with that. I want a wood. I don't know the difference between a, between a one, three, four, or whatever. I haven't got a clue. And I don't like this. Oh. See, if you don't hit the button, it just goes, whoops. <laughs> You gotta hit the button. Oh. What? I need a submarine. Is there a submarine option? Yeah, tell me about it. I don't like it. There seems to be a really limited. I don't know. I don't know where I'm meant to be putting the ball when I look at that. I ain't got a clue. I'm, what the heck? Okay. Oh. I don't know how hard I'm meant to be hitting it. If there's an indicator to tell me how hard to hit it or what. I don't know. Not a clue. Rolling down the fairway. Don't you dare go in that big puddle. Hmm. You see, this, I've played golf games, and some of them are really intuitive, and some of them, at this point, you can use your controller to select where you're aiming your ball. And on here, you can't. You, you get to... Yeah. I suppose that indicator there on the power meter is how hard I'm supposed to hit it, perhaps. I don't know. It's not at all... Oh, that was stupid. Oops. <laughs> Shut up, you smug bastard. I don't know if you can hear him. Position in the fairway on the right. Yeah, I probably don't want to put it there. Let's do that. Um, oh, God. Through someone's window, I hope. Yes, it is. He, he put it... Well, I couldn't have put it better myself, really. That would have been good if I was playing cricket. That would nearly have been a six. I mean, it reached the boundary. I'd rather punch it. I'd rather shoot it with a bazooka. It would be much more fun. I mean, I've already suggested machine guns in that tennis game. I think bazookas in golf would be a vast improvement. They they would do so much for the gameplay. All ball and stick related sports should have... Oh, God. Should have firearms. Really? Well, you said a tremendous flight. No, yeah, that's going out of bounds, Jim. Okay. Oh. Getting set. I like this spot. I like standing just here. Uh, I probably didn't want to hit it that hard. <laughs> yeah, but it makes a nice, impressive sound, though, doesn't it? <laughs> <sighs>
I do like the commentary. Taking a good look at this one. <laughs> yeah, he wants to make sure he doesn't waste one here. Why? It hasn't stopped me before. Perhaps I should be using a different club. Uh, let's try that. Maybe not. And it's up then on the green. Nice oh. right in the pin. It'll be tough to sink this in one. Yeah, I'll be lucky if I sink it in ten. A lot of golfers try and will the ball into the hole. Mm, that can help. Also helps to hit it dead center. No, I will use my telekinetic powers and dynamite. Uh, shall I try a different club? Uh, it's probably not a good idea. What was that? Oh. What, what does that do? I don't know this option. Not a clue. Who cares, let's just smack the thing and see what happens. Oh. See that? Sure isn't always sweet. That's just... I can't see if there's a hole or... No, there's not a hole there. This it's isn't... like a pendulum with plenty of pace. Here's where a soft touch doesn't do much. Shut up! See, this, graphically, it is good, but the gameplay is not intuitive. I've played PGA Tour Golf, the first one, on, I can't remember if it was the Amiga or the Mega Drive, probably both, and I've got this golf game, Turf Masters or whatever, on my Neo Geo Pocket Color, and they are both very, very intuitive. You can play them without reading the instructions. It's glaringly obvious what you're meant to do. On here, it's not. Um, I am making an ass of myself because I don't know what I'm doing and I mean I have glanced at the instructions but for something as simple as golf you shouldn't have to you should know what you're doing and I'm sure there will be people pulling their hair out saying what are you doing you idiot you should do this and that's fine but it should be obvious and it isn't and uh, this you know, I have, there's no, no marker, no indicator of how far I'm going to whack the ball, anything. It's back, isn't it? No, it's just shit. <sighs> Personally, I think it would be better with normal polygon-based graphics, you know, where you can see the hole, you can see what you're aiming at. With this, you really can't. I, you know, what... I don't know what club I'm using, whether I need to change it, anything. I don't think I can even select my club now, that's... not good. This ball ought to have its brakes checked. Stood by the hole, still in high gear. What? What are they talking about? Have I got... No. That is rubbish. Sorry, it just is. I know I smacked the ball really hard. But there was no indication that I smacked it hard when you see the ball rolling or... Nothing. You know... Look at that. You've no idea where you are on the green or anything. How far have I missed the hole by... How far in the wrong direction am I going? What? I don't know. No. Sorry, that's rubbish. I'm not going to play anymore. It is... no good. I'll hit you if you don't shut up. Yeah, sorry. That, that is... Um, the Palm Springs Open on the Philips CDI. Um, nice graphics shit gameplay. I don't like it. Thank you for watching.
This and videos of other retro games in my collection and a video of my console and computer collection can be found on my YouTube channel along with a link to my website retrogamingcollector.com so take a look at that if you've got nothing better to do. Thank you for watching.